Hello guys, welcome to Majestic Notion. Welcome to a collective reading today. Um, I realized <laughs> a couple days ago that I was very early <laughs> in my Sunday and Monday readings. That's how discombobulated I've been <laughs> through the hurricane stuff. So, um, you know, at least you got it early. I got ahead of myself there. But um, yeah, I realized that the other day. I was like, wait a minute. Today is, you know, I'm over here thinking it's later than what it is, so, um, or sooner than what it is or something, but anyways, I'm right on track again, I believe. <laughs> yes, today is Tuesday, October 4th, indeed, okay. <laughs> So let's see what we got for you guys. We're just going to do a collective. I'm going to see what the energy is like here. So I'm going to be using a lot of like Halloweenish stuff and, you know, just different things, throwing uh, different cards out there, maybe some light and dark energies. So thank you for being here, guys. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Let's have some fun. Hit that notification bell for those of you who want to know when my readings come out. And don't forget to smash that like button for me, guys. Let's see what's going on. All right, spirit, what is happening with the collective? in this beginning of October here or whenever this message finds you guys as you know collective readings are usually timeless here energy is fluid time is always an illusion one more shuffle for the collective and guys when you click on one of my videos and you can't hear it um, it's not because there's no sound for some reason either spirit doesn't want you to hear it at that moment or it's something to do with YouTube as well. So click out of YouTube and then come back in and then you'll see that it's working, okay? Because sometimes people hear them, some people don't. It's weird how that happens, but, you know. High Priestess of Fire, number five. Mm, there could be some changes within you here. You could be feeling a little passionate at this time as well. Also, maybe prone to um, batch of yeah, I'm hearing anger. Maybe um, quick to anger or yeah, because I'm hearing like firecracker. Maybe um, agitated at this time for some of you. Could be sexual frustration for some of you. Okay, but this is the high priestess of fire. Okay, it's not all negative here. This is um, you also feeling a surge. There's like a surge of ambition maybe that's coming over you, okay? You could be feeling quite confident actually at this time as well as very passionate. Um, maybe even a little aggressive, but maybe not in a bad way, okay? Just maybe a little femme fatale energy coming through here. I don't know. I feel like you're, you're getting some sort of surge of energy, okay? You're feeling like... Things are moving forward. You want to get things done. Get out of my way kind of energy. Not in a bad way. Just you're, you're ready to, to do what it is you got to do here. All right? Your soul's on fire. You feel like you're on fire. This will be a good time to go out dancing or work out also. Um, change your hair. Do something bold. Okay? I'm feeling the energy of boldness here with this some changes right making some changes in your life you're feeling that energy um, so take advantage of that energy okay use it for good use it for some good stuff all right you're highly intuitive at this time as well you're on point okay for those of you that are in tune with your spiritual gifts you might be uh, getting a little surge of uh, wisdom here some downloads here something that's gonna you're just gonna be like boom all right, let's get another one here. Yeah, focus. You're definitely focused, okay? Um, focused on your target. There could be somebody you want right now, all right? I feel like you're being direct here. I don't know. You might actually ask somebody out. You might go after that crush you're crushing on. I don't know. Some of you are feeling very determined. This could just be for work, business, um, anything you do for business, um, a certain position, a or some sort of level up in your life you want to dress different you want to do something different I don't know something is asking you to change something up 
okay the divine is with you here follow your intuition absolutely I do feel your intuition is on point number eight this is like a there's a surge within you right now okay you're gonna feel all kinds of emotions here but I feel they're good it's good energy definitely I feel like your blood's pumping okay maybe some of you are working out maybe changing up your diet here okay but you are focused it could be something you're doing a project you're working on if you work for yourself something you're starting up whatever this is you have the ambition here to do it some of you could have fire in your chart um, I would like you know you could have Sagittarius uh, Leo or Aries in your chart for some of you check what you have in your Mars okay that could be significant as well all right Let's see what else we got going on here we'll get a shadow aspect here I haven't used these cards in a while yeah these are the dark mirror oracle let's let's shuffle these we just want one spirit Somebody could be focused on you at this time as well. Um, you're looking damn good, very attractive, very magnetic energy. Yeah, we have alone in the world, number six. Okay. Some of you or someone connected to you could feel alone in the world. I honestly I feel somebody's focused on you they're feeling a little alone they're missing you or they want to talk to you they want to get to know you however this works your energy is very magnetic and drawing somebody in here at this time okay bottom of the deck here we have bride in a cage okay so definitely some of you could be feeling alone here Bright in a cage is maybe we were waiting on someone um, in vain here. And it's like they never showed up or they're just taking too long. So you might be feeling like moving on at this time is what I'm seeing. But somebody is still focused on you or you're focused on someone. 21 adding up to 3. Okay. You are magnetic, you are attracting something, but I feel like, I don't know, some of you are, are keeping it moving, okay, because you're, you're feeling tired of waiting for something that, you know, you don't know when it's going to show up, okay, you're feeling alone, you have all this energy, all this, um, I feel this inner beauty, this wisdom, this spirituality, this sexuality, this passion, this ambition, okay and you've been maybe nose to the grind working on you working on your career but you know I feel like it's time to let your hair down time to let loose and you don't want to have to wait for someone to be able to do all of this so for some of you it's definitely time to go out time to explore new options time to just be free be you and don't allow yourself to be constrained by feeling connected to something that is just for some reason just not showing up for you okay for whatever that is could be because they're in another situation they still have healing to do there could be some fuckery going on there whatever this is um, you don't want to wait anymore is what I'm seeing here okay or you're getting to that point where you're just kind of over it you know we go through emotions come and emotions go um, and at this time you feel like being maybe a little bad okay in a good way though because you've been I feel you've been maybe some of you have been celibate for a while maybe some of you um, you're just ready to have some fun okay and you know this is the season of the lovers you know the you know fall is coming um, the weather is getting nicer you know depending on where you live of course and maybe you just want to flirt a little 
All right. Maybe you just want to call your girls and hang out. I don't know. Whatever this is, get out of that funk, girl or boy. You want to get out of this funk. I can see it. So, hey, do what you got to do. Do you. All right. Let's get some tarot. Let's see. Somebody is focused on you. Hey, maybe you have somebody that you don't even know is focused on you that would like to ask you out. That actually appreciates you and is attracted to you and is not somebody that's scared to, to do, to, you know, to pursue you. Okay? This, this could be something going on here that maybe you don't see as well. For some of you, you're focused on someone, though. I say explore your options. If something's been taking that long to get to you, because you're in the energy of attraction, okay, and change. One more shuffle. Hey, that's just the name of the game in this world. You snooze, you lose. Right? Hey, you could you could be a very loyal person dedicated to someone you feel a spiritual connection to. But if it's been years and years and years and, you know, nothing is budging, um, then it's time to do you. They're Obviously, they got something going on or they're doing them. We'll see what's going on in this reading. But, hey, your loyalty can only go so far, right? You know, if you're not getting any energy in return. Okay? I don't know if I cut this deck. Let me let me just do three more shuffles here. Okay, you got a Taurus in your chart, or there's a Taurus involved here. Okay, you could be a Taurus. All right. You could be also a spiritual teacher, leader, okay? Or you're very spiritual and you are meant to be a leader, okay? Also, there could be something going on. This is definitely like spiritual connection here. There's also God energy to me. Um, yeah, you, you took an oath here on your own spiritual path or you're taking an oath whatever this is but you know you also want to live and have a good time as well all right some of you are looking for maybe a specific relationship all right some of you could be in a relationship and bored out of your mind maybe losing some interest okay yeah five of cups alone in the world under alone in the world this is depression. So if it's not you, it's somebody connected to you. They could be feeling like, you know, they want to reach out, but they can't. Okay? If we're living in depression, we're living in oppression. So there's something going on that's not letting this person shine, not letting their divinity, their light shine through. Something is, it's like putting yourself in a, in a bottle or something and... and putting yourself away wanting to break free but you can't for some reason um, so take this how it resonates okay somebody's feeling lonely desiring you or you're feeling lonely and desiring somebody or some sort of out okay yeah there will be justice okay there could be a Libra involved here or you could have Libra in your chart so there is an unjust situation going on here um, if some of you went through something, um, there will be justice for whatever this is, okay? With the Hierophant and justice, there's, there's spiritual justice here. I feel like God has an eye on you. You're very protected, okay? Somebody could be causing you pain in an unjust manner, whether they realize it or not, okay? But I feel like they do kind of realize it, um... There will be justice for whatever this is. Okay? Yeah, the hangman. 
okay? I do feel somebody could be focused on you. They could be hung up in another situation, in a marriage, in a, in a, you know, somebody here could be trying to look at things from a different perspective, right? Trying to open their mind outside of their belief system or conditioning. All right, they could be looking at you. You could be very spiritual. This person could be more religious. So, but there's something that's connecting the two of you here on a deep level. Okay. Somebody also could be learning from you. Okay. They could see you as a spiritual guru, teacher, teacher, um, someone that has a leadership energy. Okay. Knight of Wands. You know, when I see the Five of Cups and I see the Knight of Wands and feeling alone in the world, I see someone running amok, running rampant in and out of people's lives because they're avoiding their inner traumas, their inner work. So this could be someone that likes to go in and out of people's lives, get laid, keep it moving, because getting laid is the only thing that feels good to this person, but there's a big void in their heart space okay so there could be someone missing you all right take it out resonates okay but I feel like you know they could be secretly learning from you not letting you know running amok here Somebody's living a lie is what I keep hearing in the back of my mind. And justice, we have the three of wands. Okay, so you're at a distance from whoever this is. Okay, there is justice coming in for you, meaning a new day. Um, you know, you're focused on creating new things is what I'm seeing here in the process. And like I said, there could be someone else coming Somebody you don't see coming here for some of you. Yeah, we have the Knight of Swords at the bottom. This is like quick communication, coming out of left field energy, but it could be a little brash, a little immature, um, you know, no filter kind of energy. Now, I do see somebody kind of swallowing their words here, you know, swallowing the sword, meaning they want to say something, but it's like, <laughs> They don't have the, the they don't have the strength to back this communication up up. Yeah, Queen of Cups. This is somebody you had feelings for. Scorpio Pisces, Cancer. So you gave your heart to someone that basically shattered it is what I'm seeing here. And I see somebody here looking at you. Oh yeah. So yeah, you were dealing with somebody that um, they couldn't say what they had to say. Okay, they were in and out of your life. They caused you a great deal of grief here, but I feel like they're grieving more than you know. Okay, they just don't deal with their traumas. They're living a lie. But you got somebody else looking at you. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn with the Ace of Cups. Two of Pentacles. All right. So you may know about this particular person here. Because we have the Two of Pentacles, meaning you're thinking about both people. Something old, something new. Something borrowed, something blue. Uh huh. We have the Death card here. Yeah, you're putting an end to another situation, or you have. There could have been a great deal of transformation here, absolutely. Yep, there's the Empress energy. You're in the energy of attraction. So, you have two um two connections that were really intense is what i'm seeing but one is the commitment type one is the i'm sticking around type one is the provider type one is i want to get to know you type one is um you know they take their time okay they're they have a full cup to invest here the other one is flighty unpredictable shady and full of trauma and depression okay and oppression you know that's that's not the kind of person that's gonna stick around but that is definitely somebody you fell for hard 
but there's somebody else you're looking at now and with the death card here it tells me you went already through that transformation okay Scorpio energy here Taurus Leo, uh, Libra energy here page of cups you could have a crush absolutely somebody wants to um, say something okay this person could be romantic type as well they're very grounded very stable okay I feel a crush here there will be some jealousy here over this new connection whether it's because of that other person that you were connected to that broke your heart or people around both of you okay there could be some jealousy here five of swords energy because yeah the Sun is here and look how bright you both shine mm-hmm how happy day ten of cups with the Sun Woo! look at the jealousy ten of cups with the Sun okay people throwing daggers because you're happy as hell you're about to be the magician you manifested this nice collective look at the evil eye and the jealousy the rumors and the hate the naysayers against this because it's the ten of cups and the sun so if you hear anything okay for the both of you whoever is coming to your life here whoever's watching here if you hear anything any rumors any shade people throwing shade you better trust in what you got because it's the sun the ten of cups and the magician okay that's the real deal right here so if anybody's throwing shade on that when it comes together they got issues they're a hater okay absolutely yeah you might have to cut some people out two of swords you're gonna have to cut these haters out yeah it's gonna be people that missed an opportunity you're gonna be hating could be on both sides especially this one person that is unpredictable here oh yeah cuz you got options darling seven of cups look how sad this person's looking I missed my opportunity because I didn't work on myself I didn't face my fears and my traumas and I made all the wrong choices the love of my life is gone I treated her like shit or him take it out resonates I'm such an asshole I'm such a bitch the fuck was I thinking hurting them caused me the biggest pain the biggest regret now somebody's gonna have to mourn you what was that uh, meme or that saying uh, I can't remember they're gonna have to see you be happy though that's gonna be you're getting justice because of this person they definitely um yeah could be a king of swords here Aquarius Libra Gemini male or female because they, they could have treated you like an option they could have trolled someone else over you um, but they're choosing they're not choosing right they're 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 having a you know Cheap thrills is what I'm seeing here. While you're wow, while you're gonna be in the Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, hello, Ace of Wands. Look at that. Some of you, you're getting a career opportunity, or you have embarked in something new, career-wise, that's leading you to the Ten of Pentacles. But this connection, also, this is also a new romantic connection that can go the distance. Whatever this offer is take it okay ace of pentacles ten of pentacles ace of wands Ooh, king of wands oh yeah you got options here yeah be careful with one of these options there could be a fire sign here king of wands with the ace of wands this is mr king dingling here okay but there's a ten of swords backing that up so be careful with this one you you do have another option be careful with the shiny thing okay this could be someone that wants to work with you or something like that but this person comes with betrayal I don't like that they could be highly attractive highly sexual they could be definitely um, 
They could be rich, very wealthy. Um, yeah, you, you, somebody else is looking at you. Could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But Ten of Swords energy with the Tower. Ooh, no. And the Ten of Wands. No, this is a drama, drama, drama. Yeah, you got to be careful here because we have the Queen of Wands. You're going to be highly sexually attracted to each other. Queen of Wands, Ten of Wands, King of Wands. With the Ten of Swords and the Ten of Wands. The only thing holding this together is the sex. So be careful here. Ooh, be careful here. The tower is going to be really short-lived uh, because this person is a backstabber. So really watch out for this new uh, person. They're coming in hot. Nine of Wands. Yeah, they're going to play the victim. Seven of Swords. Yeah, they're the cheater type, liar type. Yeah, there's this. Do, oh my God, this will be a hard lesson. So spirit. It's going to try to move you away from this person. But you definitely have three people here. Eight of Swords. Yeah, moving forward. Knight of Cups. Some of you could have already dealt with this King of Wands, but I don't think so. I feel like this is brand new. And this would be a hell of a lesson. So be careful with that energy you're in. Um, because you're very magnetic. You could be feeling very erotic, passionate. Um, so be careful because the devil will try to bring you somebody. This is like, let me, let me, um, let me give you an offer you can't refuse kind of energy. This person, oh my God, they're going to be hard to resist. But Ten of Wands, the Tower, and the Ten of Swords, hell no. You don't want this. I don't care how good it looks. You see the attraction here. But you guys together, it's like a hot mess. This is a hot mess right here. It's all sex. So be careful with this choice. Please do be careful with that choice. Woo. Block that person. They definitely could be wealthy. Okay. But it ain't worth it. I'd stay with that King of Pentacles and uh, Ace of Cups. Okay. With the Sun and the Ten of Cups. You're the Empress, so you know. You know what's up. Where's the Sun and the Ten of Cups? We had it here. Anyways, you, you, you guys know what I'm talking about. You saw it. Oh, yeah, it's right here. Yeah, this is what you want right here. Ace of Cups, King of Pentacles, someone committed, grounded, dedicated with the sun and the Ten of Cups. This is a man your manifestation. Okay? So you might get a little test here with that King of Wands. But be careful. For some of you, it could be the past person wanting another round, but I don't think so because we saw the King of Swords, okay, with the Seven of Cups and the King of Wands. So, you got at least three options here, but there's only one. The past person, you know already that. That King of Wands, though, with that Ace of Wands, oh my goodness, that's going to be one tempting situation. Don't let the devil get you. Ooh, don't let that... That that one's going to be hard. So be careful. Careful what you wish for, darling. <laughs> Little witch sounds in the back. Um. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Let's see, let's see. I feel like that could be the person coming out of left field is that King of Wands. It's somebody new, but they come with drama. They're a backstabber. They're a cheater, a liar. Now that they could be very egotistical, they either are rich or someone that portrays to be something they're not. So be careful with that. Definitely. 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 They're highly attractive. 
They might give you the time of their life in the bedroom, but that that's all they bring. <laughs> all right, one more shuffle. I'll try to break down all three of them. We'll see. Um, if I can remember, let's see. Okay, so you have the Page of Swords. So somebody's definitely watching you. Okay, they could be learning from you. You open this person's mind to a new perspective here with the Hangman. Could be a Pisces, Taurus. And we have the Knight of Swords, which we already saw with the Knight of Wands. That's that flighty energy. Somebody depressed, feeling alone. Okay. And we have the world. So definitely with the three of wands, some of you could be traveling at this time or you're planning on going on some sort of vacation or you moved from a situation. You definitely closed out a cycle. Something was unjust and that's why justice is here. Spirit moved you away from somebody here. It's definitely this person from the past. Okay, you're, so you're more focused. All right. Definitely something new coming in. Something coming in out of left field. Somebody watching you. There could be some quick travel. Okay. It could just be commuting around your neighborhood. Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups, Page of Swords. Somebody sees you as wish fulfillment. Yes. They're looking at you. They're learning from you. They could be a leader as well. Okay. But they, they, they see you have a lot of wisdom. You are the high priestess of fire here. Queen of Wands. Yeah, this past person's highly attracted to you. So you are in that Queen of Wands energy. You're alluring, magnetic, you're ambitious, you're looking good. Everything I described in the beginning, that is the energy you are in. And it shows. They're feeling it on a soul level. Your energy speaks for itself. Seven of Cups. With the world, you have options. Absolutely. So there's an open cycle here. So that's why be careful what you choose here. Because you, you have good karma. But you could be tested. Saturn is very restrictive too, so be careful. Bottom of the deck. Yep. The Fool. All right. A whole new beginning here with lovers. There's choices. All right. And these are not just any kind of choices. The lovers is could be very, very, very complicated, very passionate. Not every lover's card is the love of your life. <laughs> Some of them are backed by the devil. They're just passionate in nature. This could be past life type of connections that you were hot and heavy with. And of course, that's how it's going to show up in this lifetime. Now, out of, out of one of these options, though, it's the right divine lover's connection. And that's that King of Pentacles with the Ace of Cups with the Magician. All intense connections, but nothing like, you know, when we get into this three-dimensional world, what happens here is what shapes you, right? So, you know, you could have a soul connection that they were born into this world and they became a narcissist. They're full of traumas like this ex here or, you know, somebody you liked or loved. You know, and you can't change that. That's what happened before they even met you, right? But some of them are in the right energy. Okay, and the connection could be just as intense, but there's love, there's stability, someone grounded like that King of Pentacles we saw. And then there's somebody like that King of Wands where it's all passion. Okay, you want to dick down, you go to the King of Wands, <laughs> but that motherfucker's full of drama and backstabbing and lies in the seat because they're on an ego trip, they got the looks, they got the dick, they know it, or the badge, whatever, they know it. They know how to use it, and they also know how to backstab. So be careful with that. Yeah, something to be learned here. You will be getting messages here, Page of Pentacles. All right. 
Some of you might work with one of these people, or you did. Eight of Pentacles here. All right. Knight of Cups. All right. There could have been some flirtation. All right. You could be a very romantic soul. I see that here. All right. Six of Pentacles. Oh, there it is. There's the King of Pentacles. So that's what you want to give to, is what I'm seeing here. There's reciprocity here. This person loves to give and receive. Um, yeah, this is a romantic person as well. They, this could be the person who wants to message you. They want to work with you. Okay, that's the new beginning. This will be the right lovers. Okay, the right lovers. Still and passionate, but very um, balanced. Okay, King of Cups. Oh, excuse me, Queen of Cups. Yes, yeah, somebody you love can love or have a major crush on okay they're looking at you they see how compassionate you are okay they see you're a loving person you're nurturing you're intuitive highly intuitive you're very attractive they are looking at you they could see you as an earth angel as well and again two of pentacles ten of swords with the strength card and the eight of swords with the two of swords good lord what is going on here could be something else going on here again Leo energy here yeah there's somebody coming out of left field yeah could be an Aries Aries or Leo or they have heavy Aries Leo in their chart yeah this person be careful they might pull the wool over your eyes an emperor here for some of you this um, king of Pentacles could have been married um, and they went through a betrayal okay because something is holding somebody back yeah the magician oh the magician with the devil and the moon and this voodoo doll with the death card yo with the five of wands holy fucking oh hell no somebody look pissed here too yes ooh. okay so that king of pentacles emperor energy could be dealing with um some sort of whoever this is man whoever this queen of pentacles is this ain't no good queen of pentacles look at this ten of swords two of pentacles the strength card yeah somebody's being held back they are definitely under psychic attack two of swords eight of swords with the magician the moon the devil this bitch could be uh, using um, voodoo dolls as well and the death card it's like this is the kind of person that's like um, over my dead body you're gonna fucking leave me that's that kind of energy there's a lot of drama here look at that darkness this is some dark shit right here so they're they're going through some rough shit here they're being held back strongly by psychic attack somebody very alpha um, could be somebody materialistic into the money they definitely have financial ties yeah they're bored clearly in this situation um, there's heartbreak here yeah they wanna they wanna come towards you six of swords with the empress okay you are their twin for some of you okay but this is gonna take some patience because man there's so much going on here then you got somebody here king of swords again with the tower there's so many people involved in this situation I don't even know if you guys realize the shit that's happening around you um, before you come together with this King of Pentacles, 
because I see there's no real communication. Everybody's wrapped up in their own, like your past person's wrapped up in their emotions, their traumas that are unhealed, running amok, okay, in and out of people's lives, still thinking about you. Your King of Pentacles is in a mess with some dark person, could be a witch, uh, doing some sort of, they're definitely under psychic attack there. Um, they could know who you are. They, they do not want this person to come to you. And then you're basically just kind of being you, being magnetic, being the empress, looking good. You know, focusing on whatever you got going on back at home or at work. Um, but, you know, you're ready to kind of have some fun, let your hair down. That's why I say there's a, that King of Wands, too, where, yeah, he's looking for something. And it even might be someone that is looking for a relationship, but they're full of ego drama. And that that, that would not go well. But the sex is good. <laughs> But don't get caught up in that one. Okay? Do not. So there's a lot going on here. And, you know, you are in a new beginning. But with those Seven of Cups, be careful. Choose wisely. Okay? Don't allow the boredom or loneliness to make you choose wrong here. Even if you say to yourself, Oh, you know, maybe I should just have a good time. And, you know, maybe some of you want to break out of being celibate. I don't know. But you might meet someone that's so enticing, be careful. Okay, that one's sent so that you don't get with your person, that new person that's really meant for you. That King of Wands is devilish. Okay? Pretty face, no good intentions. Alright. Okay. Let's see what else is happening here. Collective. Wow. Wow. October is a hot month. A lot of stuff going on behind the scenes here. So, and that King of Swords, I feel, is this um, past person. Oh, you know what? Could be. It could have been somebody else, though. Because your past person is that night energy. What was it? It was the Knight of... I mean, the King of Swords with... The Ten of Cups was behind that, but before that was what? Let me see something. The Tower. The Tower. The Tower, the King of Swords, and the Ten of Cups. There could be someone that feels a lot of chemistry towards you also. Man, I don't know, man. You you got some options. Destiny is playing a role here with this one. Mm. Five of Swords, though. Jealousy. Okay, that could be somebody, yeah, Knight of, okay, yeah. I feel like that one is a past person. Okay. Alright, let's see here. We have Chalice, Receptive, Quest, and Love. Definitely somebody sees you as their wish fulfillment. This could definitely be that Earth sign here, watching you, the one you're meant to be with. Or Pisces here. Or Pisces in their chart. Doesn't have to be. Um, let's see here. Yep. Past life going away in grief. Cemetery. That is that past person. So you did have a past life connection to that person. But this is done for. Okay. You buried it. You're ready to move on. Um, obviously they're still alive because they're in, you know, for some of you, you could be the one depressed, but for others of you, it's them. They're still running amok. Okay. Um, it's a past life connection, but that's done. What 
what else here? As I hear the owl. Wise choice, silence, and new info. So yeah, this is about making wise choices this time around. Um, this came out with it, which is lightning. Move fast, strike now, do it. Okay, so somebody clearly here wants to um, come in. They're focused on you. They could know that you, you're somebody, obviously you're very attractive, so they could know you have a lot of options here. Um, Ace, uh, Chalice here, Ace of Cups. Luna Moth, Faith, Psychic Ability, and Rest. So you have faith. Somebody could have faith in you. Obviously, High Priestess of Fire with Psychic Ability. Alright. Some of you definitely have that. And Rest. Somebody could be resting um, from that crazy connection I just saw. Cemetery, the future, answers, help, um, clarify that, sketchy, incomplete, and minimal, yeah, I told you that person was sketchy, incomplete, I feel they feel incomplete without you. Minimal, I feel like they feel like rejected. Or you, you could both be feeling that way because it was a past life connection. But somebody just wasn't in the right energy. So what can you do, you know? Something that could have been so simple becomes complicated because of somebody's behavior and lack of motivation and wanting to heal themselves or be better right all right bottom of the deck we have wealth abundance and growth all right so I did see that ace of Pentacles ten of Pentacles with that ace of wands so some of you will be um, having some sort of opportunity or you're working towards um, wealth here Oh, I don't like this. What the fuck? Wow, this is just creepy as fuck. Okay. We have killer here. Stalked, obsessed, and impulsive. Okay, what I'm getting with this is that past person could definitely be obsessed with you. They are impulsive. I can see that. And they're going through some deep, dark depression. So, you know, they could have had weird thoughts here all right they could see you as a witch you're you're a high priestess so you're highly intuitive we did see um psychic ability so they feel like you know maybe you you cast a spell on them or you know you're a witch or something like that and because of maybe some different belief systems here and this person being full of traumas here you know killer and witch i don't like that together okay this is the kind of person that destroys everything that is good in their life. Especially when it doesn't make sense in their mind. They could have a limited mindset or they could even have mental health issues. Okay. And creepy clown, old fears, defense, and courage. Yeah, this is weird. Yeah. Yeah. Werewolf. Brief phase, shift, and intense. So it was very intense okay because it was a past life connection but this is one of those connections that is just there was a destructive behavior in a past life with that person it could have been just sexual very passionate in nature you created a soul tie and boom now here this person goes this lifetime that you met them in the past and um you know life shaped them this way this lifetime they got issues okay that's why that's not meant for you that's why justice is here. You are meant because you surpassed something. You are in the Empress energy. You're probably in your life purpose or, or into that energy, getting into that energy, learning more about you and your spirituality. 
and that's why you're on the right journey and your right path and that's why you're getting justice you're getting what spirit feels you deserve to have and you deserve to have someone that is good and brings you good energy and I see that here they're looking at you they're learning from you they're watching you okay you you open this mind this person's mind to new perspectives they see that you have spiritual gifts or that you have some sort of you you're psychic or intuitive or something like that there's a depth to you that they feel here all right yeah see that's that past person with werewolf okay for some of you that king of wands is the one that's stirring up old fears okay it, the brief phase because that was a crash and burn energy okay and it's a poison apple warning deceit ill intent that's the temptation so that's for some of you here yeah some of you cut ties you're clearing out this past person or you did all right oh, there's so much going on here all right let's get some messages here what else what else Let's use my truth bomb. And hopefully I remember to you know what? Hold on one second. Let me let me shuffle these and then I'll get all those kings out. One more shuffle. Damn, 51, 58 already? Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Almost lost all those cards there. All right, before I go there, was it here? Oh, let's, let's grab it from here because we did see it here so we got the king of pentacles that's your manifestation with the ace ace of excuse me ten of cups and the sun we have this king of swords that missed the opportunity knight of swords king of swords missed opportunity and then we have this King of Wands, Ace of Wands, with the Ten of Swords in the Tower and the Ten of Wands. I mean, good lord. I want to make sure I leave it there so I remember. I mean, excuse me, King of Pentacles, and then the King of Swords. All right. So much energy, my goodness. Okay. So, blessings upon blessings. Okay, I do feel like that's the Earth sign watching. Okay with the chalice receptive here so quest and love they see you as the ten of cups all right your blessing also to each other they don't know what to do when it comes to you this is that past person okay and you are not the father Ooh. So somebody here is going through something, so they could be the ones closing out a chapter here. It says, move fast, strike now. So that's the person, I feel that's the King of Pentacles dealing with that other Queen of Pentacles with the whole witchy vibe there with the moon, the magician, the devil, and um, I don't know what else was there. Damn. So that's what they're dealing with. 
Okay. I don't. I feel like this King of Wands. You just don't see this coming. Yeah, meant to be with blessings upon blessings. That's the King of Pentacles here in this first row. That's what I'm getting. So they definitely could be a Taurus for some of you. Or a Pisces. Someone is plotting against you. That's your past person. This is the kind of person that feels emotional for you, but it, they, it, it hits them in a negative way. So the kind of person that gets revenge. So they could feel like it doesn't matter what they did to you. They they play the victim. They they project. They turn it around and make you feel like the bad guy. The kind of person that could be talking a lot of shit about you, spreading lies and rumors. Okay, fifty five, fifty five on the clock. This lesson is gonna sting a little. Yeah, somebody is learning a major lesson here with you are not the father. Okay, um, that could be this past person, I mean, not this past person, this king of pentacles. There's a lot, a shit ton of drama that this king of pentacles is going through. Okay. Shit's gonna hit the fan. Yeah. Okay. So, there's a lot of jealousy too. That person's very controlling. They have him under psychic attack. Um, they have them the two of swords, the eight of swords, and the strength card. Meaning this person has a very alpha controlling personality over this king of pentacles but shit's gonna hit the fan all right yeah when the cat's away the mice will play deceptive behavior that's the past person you got right here okay now for some of you you know take it how it resonates because it's general you could be dealing with one situation or the other some of you you're dealing with the whole reading okay yeah, fake accounts. Okay, so somebody could be making fake accounts either to keep an eye on you or this person that they're dealing with. Uh, there's there's a lot going on there. Yeah, remember that five of swords surrounded by naysayers. When you guys come together, there's going to be so much shit. Yeah, that person has an unhealthy attachment to this king of pentacles. Okay. Um, or it's this past person that has an unhealthy attachment to you because they're repeating patterns, definitely. Okay. This person is not learning. They don't have the mental capacity, I feel, to learn here because I feel like they have mental health issues with that killer card. Okay. They could have some really dark thoughts. Yeah. Call a friend and have some fun. Yeah. Be careful with that okay oh oh okay so yeah this is that king of pentacles then they are the ones that have a lot of naysayers surrounding them okay that person they're with definitely has an unhealthy attachment because I saw their over my dead body kind of energy she don't want you to have him okay repeating patterns it's probably because they feel stuck in that situation. We do have the hangman and the high priest, I mean, excuse me, the hierophant. Meaning this person sees you as wish fulfillment, as a blessing, but they feel stuck because they're dealing with a fucking psycho. Okay? And this bitch, in a relationship and acting single, call a friend and have some fun. Someone is pregnant, right? We have here, you are not the father. So, they're dealing with a shit show. You were dealing with a shit show, but you're no longer dealing with this person. I mean, damn. Yeah, they're trying to say they're a thing of the past. Okay. It's time for you to shine. So, maybe they are a thing of the past now. This um, karmic that they were dealing with. Maybe they found out about this pregnancy. Okay. There is ten of swords there too. Okay, I mean, yeah, it's it's time for prosperity is yours and abundant path. That's that ten of cups energy with the sun and this king of pentacles, and you can't stop this. That person that they were with, they can't stop this. Nobody can. It's a manifestation. You're meant to meet this person. They're your justice. You are their justice as well. Yep, 
long-term potential. Yeah, they are truly into you. They were resisting, okay? But the more they resist, the more it persists because you're meant to, you're meant for each other. That that's actually the love of your life. Okay, Ace of Cups, the Sun, Ten of Cups. Yeah, let me put a smile on that face. It's big surprises, Spirit. So Spirit's trying to surprise you. And that's what it is. Yeah, true love surrounds you. Ooh we. Yeah. They could have had a hard time understanding, or maybe you, when this shows up. It says you're the only one that needs to understand why this is your blessings. No matter what other people have to say, no matter the naysayers, you saw it. The magician, the sun, the ten of cups. Okay? And the ace of cups. So you're gifted. Explore that shit. And change is inevitable. Roll with the punches. Voila, darling, voila. Yeah, and I saw the Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. You will be the first multimillionaire in your family. You're, you're chosen. Okay, that could be what draws in that King of Wands energy also, so be careful. Yeah, somebody was definitely, that King of Pentacles was being taken for granted. Stop allowing yourself to be taken for granted. You're better than that. This could also be the King of Pentacles that's meant to be a multimillionaire. They are chosen, but maybe they just didn't understand that. They're understanding this now. And I feel like both of you together would be very prosperous. Okay? It could be due to the two of you working together. Yeah. You're worth more than that. All right. Um, I do want to see what this bitch got going on, though, too. Cause this bitch crazy. I mean, damn, the moon, the devil, the the magician, and this voodoo doll. Somebody definitely with the death card. Uh -uh. Somebody witchy as fuck. They're probably pissed off because this is over, right? They're a thing of the past, that's what they said. Yeah, five of wands, ten of swords. Look at all that fucking drama. They probably got other people also to uh, betray this person, or they're trying to. This bitch ain't no joke, man. And on top of that, they had him in competition, because they got pregnant by somebody else. They're not the father. Alright, so we'll leave this crazy person for last. Alright, let's talk about the King of Pentacles, even though that energy is pretty apparent here. That is the love of your life, right here. The Magician, Ten of Cups, the Sun, and the... King of Pentacles, we also saw the Ace of Cups with that. You can rewind it if you don't believe me. It was there, right next to the King of Pentacles. All right. Uh, tell me about this King of Pentacles. Clearly, this is the love of your life. I mean, we just pretty much saw what we needed to see there. Hold on. I dropped something. Yep. Ten of Cups. Confirmation. Spiritual Connection. High Priestess. High Priestess. That is your emperor. Okay. And they could have been married. Alright. They could have children as well. Could be an Aries for some of you. Sagittarius. Yeah, three of swords. They could be going through a heartbreak. 
Definitely. I mean, after this Queen of Pentacles, this ain't the this ain't no match. She just a gold digger. Not with all that shadow shit, you know. The magician. Double confirmation. So there could be healing at this time. Yeah, definitely. King of Pentacles with the Emperor, this is definitely a provider. They could definitely have their own business, be very successful. Yeah, this is, this sounds, that this looks like this could be a lawyer here. Yeah, oh, okay. This could be the person that this person slept with also, Ten of Swords. They could have also been betrayed by a friend, a family member here. What is this King of Pentacles of Swords? Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Two of Wands. Yeah. They're ready to... Yeah, Tower. Scorpio Energy. They're ready to leave that behind. It's all rubbish. Yep. That's the end of whatever relationship or marriage that is there. Four of Wands with the Tower. Yeah. Yeah, they were dealing with karma with the seven of pentacles and and uh, judgment here for some time. Okay. But they see clearly now. Um, they could have lost some money. Five of pentacles, four of cups. Uh, dealing with this person. Okay, they're stressed out. Five of wands with this four of cups. There was a lot of fucking stress and drama there. Look at this person. They could be drinking right now. <laughs> drinking more than they usually do. Um, you know, maybe. I don't know. But this person's stressed. Okay. They're holding back. Alright, they're hoping you're not going to walk away. This is the person you're meant to be with. Damn, they got played. They got played. All right. They're a good person. Very good person. Uh, they just got taken advantage of. Not Definitely not like this past person you were dealing with or this king of um, wands. I feel this is your past. Let's talk about this king of swords because they missed the opportunity. Four of cups. Knight of swords. See, sometimes a lot of people see the King of Swords and they think, oh, this is somebody very wise and they got their shit together. You know, I don't read reversals. I read the surrounding cards and the energy that I feel that emanates from a specific um, combination of cards. And with this energy here, that tells me everything. So this is not a stand-up guy. This is a guy with a lot of issues. They might portray to the world that they got it together. Deep down inside, they don't. So let's talk about this person. You know, of course, it's not always the case, but in this case, absolutely. Four cups. Yeah, they know they missed the opportunity here. Definitely, they could be drinking because this person is reckless. They could be drinking and driving also. Definitely, this is a deceiver, a liar kind of energy. Yeah, you moved on from that successfully with the chariot. Yeah. Riding off into the sunset, darling. Need we say more? I mean, you already know. It's a new day for you. You already have a manifestation here, so why even bother there? We already tapped into that. Okay. So let's talk about this King of Wands because I feel like this is something you just you don't see. Let's see what this is about. What is this mess, spirit, you got going on here? What is this King of Wands, King Dingling here with the Ace of Wands, Ten of Swords, Tower, and Ten of Wands energy? What the hell is that? It, it gives me like this is new because we have the Ace of Wands here, so. But this ain't the wand, darling. 
<laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay. What is this King of Wands spirit? Oh, the moon, darling. You don't see this one coming. Oh, this person in the shadow. Lurking in the shadows. Oh, man. This, the, yeah, the, this. You heard that? Uh-huh. This ain't the one. This person lives in hell is what I heard. <laughs> yeah, this is a, this is a trapper. They're going to try to trap your ass. The moon with the eight of swords. Ooh, this person lives in their shadow. What else here? The hermit. Okay. They, they could be very depressed at this time. I don't know. Okay. Virgo energy. You, you could be in your hermit mode right now, alright, so you don't see this coming. Yes, having a swords again. We saw that earlier with that king of wands. Wow. Damn, somebody could be sneaking. Somebody could be watching you. What is this? Judgment. Oh, this could be a past, another past person. Yeah. That missed the opportunity. Oh, you got some past people here uh, creeping. See, this other person, even though you love them, they still missed the opportunity. So that means you wised up quick enough and you left. No matter how much it hurt, you still walked away. Somebody here also missed the opportunity. Five of Swords. So you know what you're doing. You might have fell for it for a second. Yeah. You cut this motherfucker off, whoever this is. Queen of Swords that ass. So this could have been an ex-boyfriend, actually. So this is somebody you were in a connection with. The Tower hit, the Ten of Swords hit, the Ten of Wands hit. This was very heavy. So this person wanting to come back around and you're like, hail to the fucking no. So this is an actual ex. This other person that was flighty was somebody that you had deep feelings for, but nothing, it never got off the ground. This was actually somebody you had a really good sexual chemistry with, but they were a cheater, a liar. They have a lot of dark secrets. Could have been a Sagittarius. Wow. So the tower hit there. Yeah. Yep, that's the truth. Ace of Swords. And you got the clarity and truth on that. You definitely don't want this person near you. Yeah, you learn a big lesson there. Six of Swords. So this person's still watching. So you know this devil. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. You could have felt like uh, needy around this person, rejected around this person, because there were you. There was a high attraction between the two of you. Um, the sex was really good. Um, but this person made you feel like you weren't enough. Okay, that's an ex-boyfriend. I can see that here. Wow. Yeah. You're like, that's fucking done. Done, done. Scorpio energy, Leo energy here. Yeah, again, Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. You're focused. Okay, there's something you're doing, learning, studying. is going to lead to lots of riches. So this is all Pentacles. Two of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. Whatever you're doing is working. It's going to work for you. Okay? So keep focusing on whatever you got going on. Yeah. You're studying. You're doing something. You're single. Okay? You're working on yourself. Healing. Um, yeah. 
you could have a couple things, a couple ideas here, creating a few things. Um, just keep doing what you're doing. Wow. All right. Good Lord, what a reading. A lot of energy. So this this, this past person still watching, still feeling you, wanting to come back around. You're like, hell no. You queen of swords, that ass. So, this could have been an ex from a long time ago, this king of wands. And, you know, you're very different now. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> that witch laugh reminds me of, like, I wish a motherfucker would. <laughs> um, yeah. You will not be falling for that ding -a -ling again. I can tell you that much. It might have been good, but it ain't that good. <laughs> Not for that Ten of Swords, Ten of Wands energy all over again. Hell no. All right, let's let's just get. Uh, uh, let's get a card for each of these. Oh, I almost forgot. A little Miss Crazy here. I want to know this person's doing magic because I see it here. This is all dark. I mean, this is clearly, this is why I say, this is not, when you see the queen and the king of pentacles, but you see everything that's going on within the connection, you know this bitch ain't the upright queen of pentacles. This is a gold digger. And she's doing all kinds of shit to keep this person stuck. And has him in competition. Betrayal. Ten of swords, five of wands. With, you're not the father and someone is pregnant. Okay? Whether she had an abortion or not, I don't know. But she got pregnant for somebody else. So let's see what they got going on here. And I'm going to need some words for this one. <laughs> I need some words. We'll get some words in a second. Let's see. Let's see what else comes on. This is the person your King of Pentacles was with. Tell me about this Queen of Pentacles. Ace of Wands. Okay, there could be some sex magic involved here. This was passionate in nature. Definitely. Yep. Definitely. We already have the magician and the moon with the devil. There's sex magic here. So they're trying to keep them under their spell. Yeah, whether you believe in it or not, that's what they do. They could be a queen of swords, a Libra, Aquarius, Gemini energy with Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn um, energy in their chart placements or they could be a earth sign with um, it's not the, this is not the right Queen of Swords not with all this fuckery okay so the Queen of Swords can be um, a crazy chick with the moon, the magician, the devil uh-huh the magician and the ace of wands here with the moon no this ain't right and definitely, she was having sex somewhere else. This could be a Jezebel energy, Lilith type of energy. This could be a drinker, Nine of Cups. Okay. Yep. <laughs> Somebody drinking, and yeah, it's definitely her. Yep. They, they, they got, they're suffering from depression. Same energy your your past person is suffering. Yeah, because there's other people involved here. They they know that this King of Pentacles is meant to be with you. And they know this. And they also had somebody else. Obviously, they got pregnant by somebody else. They're regretting that shit now. Because clearly, I feel like this... Um, 
shit's gonna hit the fan. So they might not know yet, but shit's about to hit the fan. They might find that out. So much information, my goodness. That Four of Cups keeps coming out. Yeah, Four of Wands. Yeah, somebody cheated. Seven of Cups, Four of Wands, Ace of Wands with the Magician. Yeah, trying to keep this person held back. Strength card. That person is very egotistical as well. Four of Cups keeps coming out. Yeah, Three of Pentacles, Knight of Cups. They were romancing somebody else. Yeah, they're done there. Okay. Yep, Seven of Pentacles. That's done. That's over. Um, I do want to get some... Let's see what else here. Ugh. Can you imagine, like, the breath of fresh air that you're both going to feel, like, meeting each other after dealing with all these types of people you both are a blessing to one another like my goodness tell me more about this uh, karmic here this person could have just been projecting a lot Yeah. Yeah, the heat was on. It was undeniable attraction and chemistry. Here. Again, it was all sexual. Okay. Yeah, there was uh there's definitely a lot of naysayers around this person. Okay, fake friends, haters, gossip keep doing you, you're doing something, right? So it's time to cut out some people. Look at this. Oh, I'm glad it came out that way. Look at this. They thought it was their twin. It says, this is not your twin flame. This is your twin flame. That means you are their twin flame. That's why there's a blessing here. And this person tried to come in as they were a twin. Their twin, they're not. Clearly, look at this darkness this person embodies. It was all attraction. That means that was the wrong lovers with the devil. People, sometimes people don't understand. The lovers with the devil is not always a divine connection. It's temptation to steer you away. That when the fool runs into the lovers which we already saw the fool here you have the right choice which is a light path or you have a dark path this is a path of complication backstabbing the sex is good the attraction is there the chemistry is there but everything else is crazy shit now between you and this person is the right lovers that's why you have the sun the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. That's the right twin flame. Not this shit. The wrong. This is a fake twin if I ever saw one. This this karmic right here. So they see all that, that they had to go through to cast this facade, this smoke and mirrors over this person. They, they're having sex behind their back with other people. Ten of Swords, Five of Wands. This is not, you are not the father. Somebody's pregnant. Shit's going to hit the fan. That's what I'm saying. People don't want to hear, though. They don't want to listen, though. Whoa. <laughs> We're not taking all of that. People don't want to listen. Y'all don't hear me, though. Yep, can't make it up. Someone is lying. The truth will be revealed to you. With shit's gonna hit the fan. 
Mm -hmm. I never believed in soulmates till I met you. You threw me for a loop. That could be when they saw you, it was like, wait a minute. How can I be with my twin if I feel so drawn to this other person? It's because you are their real twin. They could have met a past life karmic, okay? Which is the same thing you had here. You met a past life person. Intense, sexually, yes. Wrong person because this is not... This is not the person you're meant to be with. You just had a sexual connection to this person in a past life. It was probably very hot and heavy, and you met them again this lifetime. Same thing here. That was a lesson. Okay? So you're mirroring your twin. They're mirroring you as far as the things that you have gone through in, in relationships. You know, maybe not exactly to the T, but pretty fucking close. Yeah. Then there was a lot of naysayers trying to keep these two people together. Um, they could have been talking about you, you know, and there could have been haters saying, oh, you know, that's not for you or, you know, stuff like that. Because it says, I no longer care what other people have to say about my decisions. Time for rest and rejuvenation. Take it easy. So they're taking a step back. Okay. They're obviously watching you. They understand what's going on now. Yeah, and some of their friends, of course, they think you're hot, okay, they tell me I should go for it. So, you know, obviously, they're not all going to be naysayers, but there are some that are, okay? Because some might favor this other person. They could be charming as fuck on the outside. They're the devil in disguise. Yeah, I might fear what I'm about to do, but I'm going to do it anyways. Go for it. So there you go. Boom. I mean, damn... Need we say more? I'm going to end it right here. Empath, empath, connection, mutual respect, healing energies. You both have healing energies. The right twin. Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, and the Sun. I mean, do we really need to say more? With your chosen and you're meant to be a multimillionaire. Both of you. Manifestation. I mean, it's pretty clear. Yeah. It, this could be a, a person you don't even see coming. Or you do see them coming, but they couldn't come to you because they were in this shitstorm here. It says, I need you to stop being so enticing. I'm thirsty for you. A new crush surrounds you. Wink, wink. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm addicted to your essence. I'm so into you, the hunger is real. Yeah. The choice is yours, follow your intuition. Their intuition is screaming, you are the one. Alright guys, that's what I have for you. This was a very interesting reading. Wow, so much energy to sort through. You know? A lot of people involved here. But we got through it. We got through it. Okay? So take it how it resonates, guys. These are general. They're not. This is not for everybody. But um, wow, talk about a journey, right? And there's still more to come. But it's a beautiful fucking day with the ace of of cups, ace of the sun, and the ten of cups with the ten of pentacles and the ace of pentacles, by the way. Okay. <laughs> so. Wow. I wish you the best. Let me know in the comments if anybody resonates. Thank you for watching, guys beautiful collective energy at the end of the day so get ready all right guys god bless bye bye